girl Gladys, aka Is That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. So first, I really want to give a huge thank you to everyone who has subscribed to my channel. As I stated in my giveaway video, we've reached a thousand subscribers and beyond. We're at like over 1100 right now. Woohoo! So I'm super excited about that. Make sure you tune into the giveaway video. There'll be a link to it at the screen above and enter because it goes until Monday. All right, so I'm back with another wig review for you. And this unit here is called Venetia. So here's Venetia's stock car. Venetia is by Free Trust Equal. And they have her in this cute 613 color, but I really want to try the copper. So yes, here we are. So on to the specs of this wig. This wig comes with your standard cap construction. You have two combs here in the front, a comb in the back, and adjustable straps. So here are the pros of Venetia. The reason why I got her is because I liked that it was a shorter cut and I, I really like the curl pattern. I watched a few reviews and I said to myself, okay, I could work with Venetia, she's cute. And also the price point was super cheap. I know I paid under $20 for her. Another thing I liked about Venetia was this copper color. I love copper on my skin tone. I know I haven't showcased a lot of that on my channel yet, but you'll see how much I love copper later on. Another thing I like about Venetia is just that she came as a shorter style. I like shorter hair all year round. I get very scissor happy even when I have longer units. I kind of cut them up, chop them up. So for her to already come short was a really big plus for me. However, for me, Venetia took some work. For one, this is not a lace front. This is a lace part wig. So there was no lace to cut. Literally took her out the pack and plopped her on my head. When I did that, it immediately looked like helmet hair. So I had to take my curling wand and flatten on the top, which was fine. And also the part wasn't laying flat, so I did have to cut a V and lay it down. If you wanna know what it looks like to cut a V in your lace, I'll link a video to that in the description box and above here. Once I got the part together, that was fine, but then the style of this unit was really bothering me. I saw it on other YouTubers and I thought she was very cute, but on me, I was not feeling her at all. First of all, my number one pet peeve when it comes to curly units is when the curls are going all types of directions. Like, look here. This curl is going this way. Wh where's this curl going? It's going like this direction. Like, it's going two different directions. So it's not even laying the way I want it to lay like this side versus this side. This is cute. This is trash. That's pretty much how I feel about it. That was pretty much my main con, the style of the wig. I had to do work to it. As you can probably tell by the stock card, it did come longer, so I didn't like that. I wanted it shorter, so I just cut her, and then it was all the same length, so I definitely had to add layers. I probably should have showed you guys how I did that. So hold on. So to add the layers, all I did was literally just take strands up here, and then I just cut down like so. It that's all I was doing, and I did it pretty much all the way around the unit. I also took pieces here and would just chop it off like, whoop, all around the unit until I liked the layers that I put in the unit. Me personally, I think she looks a lot cuter, shorter, so I was happy that I cut her. And also, I brushed her out. The natural curls that this unit came with, once I had it on me, it looked really... I don't know, it just made it look really synthetic-y to me. It just didn't look, I didn't like it. So I, I brushed it out with my paddle brush to make a more softer wave. And these curls are stubborn because they were trying to revert back real quick and it's still doing it, as you can see. But when I brushed it out, it was super cute. That leads me to another thing. You see this? The tangling. Like, it's curly, but it's short. I just don't feel like I should be experiencing the tangling that I was experiencing while brushing this unit. Ugh, I don't know you guys, I'm sure you all have your own opinion. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of Venetia. Personally, it's not an automatic repurchase for me. I think I did the best I could with her and made it work, but I wouldn't get another one. I like the cut, the way I cut her. I like the color a lot, but that's about it. The cap construction I'm not really for and the style, the way it came was so, so to me. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Thank you so much for bringing us to 1K. I'm so, so pleased and so, so happy. Like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.